Hi, I'm Paul DeBartolomeo. Welcome to Training Minutes. In this segment, we're going to talk about streamlining our airbag capabilities. As we see here, we have a Pelican-style carrying case for our airbag components. We have our uh, pressure regulator, our controller, various hoses, adapters, and we even carry a few airbags in here. This is a good transport case, but it's a little bulky and it's a little heavy to have on the fire ground. What we've done in order to make our operation a little more efficient is strip down an old SCBA harness. As you can see, we removed the high pressure coupling and the high pressure hose. We've removed the pressure reducing assembly, the low pressure hose, and the regulator. Basically, what we're left with essentially is a wireframe backpack, which we can utilize an air cylinder in to streamline our operation. This assembly is suited for a half hour bottle, a 45 minute bottle, we can even put a one hour bottle in here which is going to maximize our airbag potential. Basically the way we have this set up is very similar to the way we would use this as a standard SCBA. We carry the cylinder in there the same way. We pre-rig our Paratech regulator. We leave the regulator preset at 135, so all we have to do at an emergency scene is turn the bottle on and the regulator is preset to go to work. What we have here is a four foot length of high pressure hose. It's like a cheater length. What we do with this, we pre-rig one, one end into the regulator. We leave the second end into the controller. We keep this in the apparatus pre-assembled so when we arrive on the scene of an emergency, one firefighter can come over to that compartment, grab this piece of equipment, put it on, and we're ready to go to work. This assembly allows the firefighter to get on scene with all the components he needs. He can hook up. He's remote from the scene so he can take an overview. He can control the scene and he can control the lift on the other firefighter's call. This is equipment that you probably have in the basement of your firehouse. It's readily available and it gives you a nice, nice little setup to use at airbag emergencies. I'm Paul DeBartolomeo. Thank you for watching Training Minutes.